Hey, this is gonna be a quick video about the Synology and CES 2025. As you know, Robbie is there in Las Vegas um, talking to all these brands and the videos are coming up slowly. But uh, the one highlight which I wanted to uh, let everyone know of is new Synology B Station Plus. They have updated the previous B Station which had four terabyte hard drive inside. Now it seemed to be a new hardware in that NAS. So first of all, thanks uh, to Lon TV, who was um, recording a little bit of footage of uh, that Synology stand. And uh, we can see that the size is exactly the same, but the hardware is slightly different. So instead of um, Realtek CPU, now we are having more powerful Celeron CPU. It's still an old CPU, but it can perform much, much better. It has a uh, transcoding feature, built in on the hardware level. Synology doesn't take advantage of it, but maybe down the line they will start doing it. You also get eight terabyte storage. Um, some uh, sources say it's a ter eight terabyte hard drive, but other places say it's actually uh, flash based. Two SSDs inside, so two times four terabyte would make eight terabyte, because SSDs are smaller and that one bay could allow to 2.5 inch SSDs or even NVMe SSDs to be placed in this case. You also get USB 3.2 uh, Gen ports, which is 10 gigabit, which is really good if you want really fast backup. Um, the rest of the, the things stay the same, but this is, for those that didn't know what this B station is, it's very similar to WD NAS, uh, like uh, Dua on, on those models. Uh, but it's a very simplified version because you can set it up in literally two to three steps. You need to scan the QR code, create the username, password, and that's it. You can pack up your photos, your files, you can use it for um, storage, for anything you can think of. Uh, the sources, if you want more information about this, you can go to Tech Power Up. This is where they mention about uh, having SSDs inside the case. Uh, you can also go to um, Kashi's blog. He also talks about uh, what is inside this NAS and what his thoughts are about this. Uh, I also wanted to mention that recently Black Void uh, made an article about new update, uh, B Station version 1.3, which uh, actually have new feature uh, enabled, which is iCloud Photos Backup, which means you don't need a middleman anymore uh, for backing up uh, your iPhone photos or your tablet photos. Or if you are a Pixel user, Android user, you can back up those photos as well automatically from the cloud to the NAS. And also Synology is now offering cloud backup for the B station itself. So you can have this NAS backed up to a remote destination to keep your data safe just in case there is a disaster like flood, fire and things like that. Um, if you want to follow up um, what is going on in CES 2025, you can uh, either go to Ko-Fi or Patreon or on YouTube uh, subscribers list and you'll get a new videos what is going on straight uh, happening at this moment in Las Vegas. Uh, otherwise, stay tuned and I'll update you if there is any new uh, hardware being released at any time.